Welcome back, familia. Erica put me onto this song. She says, this is the next one I should listen to. And here we are. This is Corey Asbury, a song called Kind. Sometimes marriages don't work. Sometimes babies die. Sometimes rehab turns to relapse. And you're left just asking why. <laughs> and for all the prayers I pray. I still wonder if he's real And if he is, how is he choosing Who he does and doesn't heal I've tried to run from Jesus I've started holy wars I've tried the patient waiting And the kicking down the doors I've cursed his name in anger With my fist raised to the sky and in return, all he's ever been is kind. <laughs> and I burned my share of bridges. I learned to tuck my tail and run. To watch the wreckage in the rear view. From all the crooked things I've done. And I know that he forgives me. But it's hard to forgive myself. I can't help but think amazing grace is for everybody else. <laughs> I tried to run from Jesus. I started holy wars. I tried the patient waiting and the kicking down the door. I cursed this day in anger with my fist raised to the sky. And in return, all he's ever been. When I look up at the cross, I see the darkest day in history, and I guess that's what kindness costs. I tried to run from Jesus, and I started holy wars. I tried to pace and wait it, oh, and it's killing me. dude man probably the most honest songwriters out there right now oh for those of you who've been following my story in the last couple of weeks you know like this really hits home because i just lost my father and uh he he was really sick and i prayed and i asked all of you to pray for me and for his uh for his healing and um, unfortunately, we lost him. And, and you can't help but wonder, like, why? Like, how does, how does God really choose which ones he heals and which ones he doesn't? And, you know, the, the old me probably would have cursed God. Probably would have demanded answers and, and turned away. But... And not the new me. <laughs> the new me clung to him as tightly as I could. And I went, I went for this crazy ride. I went for this crazy ride with God. And even though in my atheist days, I turned away from him and I was, I was unkind to his people and I cursed him and didn't believe in him. All he ever was, was kind. Man, Corey, bro, um, your songwriting is on a whole different kind of level, man. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. Even though I was completely in my, in my sorrow, in my pain, in my suffering, 
I heard every every note, every melody. That bass player is amazing. The style fits you very well, man. Um, it's sort of like this laid back, sort of country feel. I feel a folky feel to it. It's perfect for you, man. And the the way that you use your voice is amazing. You truly have a, a, a very special gift, man. I can only imagine how many people were touched by your song just like I was. I just recently lost my father and, and it's been it's been challenging, man. The, the the evil forces are still trying to to taint this and to to get to me and and all I can do is just cling on to God and 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 hold on to him and and trust in him. And this song was very special, man. I, you're going to get like a thousand replays from me. <laughs> I'm going to play this song over and over and over again until I flush all of this out. And thank you, Corey, for this beautiful song, man. I'm going to give this song 333 trillion Archies, man. This is a beautiful, beautiful song. If my life had a soundtrack, I would definitely add this tune to it. As a former atheist who blamed God for all the terrible things that happened to my life, I turned against him. I went into bad decision-making and bad habits and just living the life of... of your typical atheist. And it was Corey's song who brought me back home, man. It was uh, it was Reckless Love that brought me back home. And now this song is definitely going to be a part of this because you nailed it, man. You nailed it. Everything that I felt before when I was an atheist, you know, putting my fist up in the air and cursing his name, that was me. I relate to this. A thousand percent I relate to this. And looking back, I'm like, man, he was still good to me. He was still kind. He still looked after me. He still looked after my family. Even though I wasn't for him, he was always for me. And Familia, please remember that. Don't let anybody take that away from you. You have a God that is with you always. No matter how you treat him, he will always uh, treat you back with kindness. He will always respond with kindness because that's just who he is. That is the God that we serve. Is a is a kind, loving God.